It's time we talk about Webflow's e-commerce. Hey everybody, what's up? So Webflow's e-commerce is now out for beta for everybody and it's time for me to share kind of what I think about this. It took some time for me to dig into this because I was so busy with everything else going on in my life but I took the time to look into it right now and I want to share my thoughts with you now as you've previously seen in the intro and as you probably know Webflow um, are a sponsor of this channel and I'm in very good communication with them and I love everything that they do. I'm a super evangelist of them. That being said, this specific video is kind of my views and my take on their e-commerce solution and as you'll see in a second, it's super, super honest um, and it's only my opinion. So here's what I think about this and I want to start usually you know people start with kind of the good thing and then they're going to the bad things. I want to do this the opposite way around. So here's the first thing about Webflow's e-commerce. First thing is I can't actually use it because to use Webflow's e-commerce you have to have a Stripe account. I'm based in Israel and unfortunately at the moment I can't have a Stripe account which is it's by the way it's a struggle for me with all of my businesses um, and it just means that I can't use it at a moment um, as Webflow has said in their blog post when they release the e-commerce they're about to they will add PayPal and other payment providers in the uh, in, in the future but as of this moment when they're la launching if you want to set up uh, a store you have to have a Stripe account so again you have to be in a country where Stripe is operating um, in Israel so I don't have Stripe in here so honestly that means I can not give it a real try not for myself because I wanted to set up my own shop and not for a client work if I want to use um, an e-commerce platform that kind of so that's the first context of this review I can't actually use it so I can't really tell you how it feels like to work with it second thing is to be super super honest I don't have a lot of experience with e-commerce um, I usually work with startup companies kind of usually it's software companies that it's not e-commerce companies and usually what I use Webflow for for them is to set up their um, marketing website their blogs and those kind of platforms and for that Webflow is a super super great solution I just didn't have an experience building shops and so I've never actually used any e-commerce platform not Shopify not everything else in that context it's hard for me to judge what is better what is worth what works and what doesn't work but so again that is the context the context is I've never actually built an e-commerce site in my life now that being said let's jump into what is super exciting about this and why I think this is a move in the right direction I've shared with you like recently when I was building up the sales page for uh, my Webflow Masterclass, I was building it uh, on a platform, selling my course on a platform called Teachable. And with Teachable, I had to build my sales page on their platform. And I had to um, learn how to develop in something called Liquid. And that's something that's like, to customize it eventually I made a video about how I ended up designing it in Webflow and exporting the code and moving it up to there but it was and I had to hire a developer to help me solve all the CSS issues and everything just to make my sales page look legit now that is exactly what happens for designers who are trying to build e-commerce websites for their uh, clients or for themselves and they're working with within other platform whether it is Shopify or WooCommerce or something else and they want to do a custom design they want to set up specific experience for either their their product grid or their checkout experience and stuff like that and they can't do it or they have to you know hire um, have to hire a developer to do this have to learn liquid or whatever to, to customize uh, because it's a system it's dynamic it's not just copying pasting HTML and CSS it's very very complicated to do and so I think that empowering designers to take control and do it themselves without having to either you know I, I saw a lot of people using Webflow to design e-commerce then exporting it and setting it up on other platforms but that is a struggle and a pain just like I had to export my page and so now the designers can actually do it and set up the shops within Webflow I think it's super super powerful so people who are designing e-commerce and have a good fit um, 
in terms of they need custom design, they want to have control and ability to to design the whole process from the product to the really you know interactions and experience of the checkout process then i think that this is super it's going to probably be a, a very good solution for them and i think it's it's a move in the right direction in terms of designers who will be able to set up the whole website and the whole website for the client because usually a store is in any way hooked up with a website with a blog with everything else so right now designers have to work within multiple platforms and set everything up for their clients right now it's going to be only one web for website and that's going to make everybody's life much easier so again it's pretty frustrating for me that I can't use it at the moment and show it because I really wanted to build my own store and do a case study for you and, and experience for myself so I'm a little bit frustrated right now that I can't do it but I'm super excited for you guys plus I have a super generous offer from Webflow. So if I want to hear from you as designers who are building e-commerce website, and if you'll share in the comments like what you're excited about, maybe what you're frustrated about, what you're hoping to, so I, I will have feedback to better understand the current situation of uh, Webflow's e-commerce. Um, Webflow suggested to give a $300 coupon to your Webflow uh, e-commerce website. So share your opinion, your thoughts. I want to hear your thoughts about their e-commerce solution in the comments and hopefully you can get that coupon. Talk to you guys next week.